I am Kristen Perez and I am the Retail Sales Manager. So at Liberty Oxygen, we're contracted to accept most insurances. Um, any of our customer service reps at any of our eight locations can help the customers to determine if we take that insurance and what it takes to get something covered. For a lift chair though, the most that is ever going to be paid by any insurance is going to be on the lift mechanism. And that dollar amount will differ, but at this time it's in the around $360, but that's not an exact amount. Um, in order to get that part paid, and again it's just the lift mechanism because the rest of the chair is considered a furniture item, the patient has to have a neuromuscular disease such as Parkinson's or severe arthritis of the lower limbs, meaning knees, ankles, but not back. A lot of people feel that a, a back injury or back surgery should be covered. It is not. The patient also has to be unable to stand from a normal chair on their own, but able to walk once standing, and that means even walking with a walker. A lot of times people feel that they cannot stand from a normal chair on their own, yes, but they're using a scooter or a wheelchair that has been purchased by their insurance company. If a wheelchair or scooter has been purchased by your insurance company, they are not going to buy a lift chair. The criteria um, contradicts itself. A scooter or a wheelchair is paid by the insurance company because someone cannot walk, but a lift chair criteria, as we talked about, only is paid if a person can walk once standing. So just because someone has a wheelchair or a scooter, it, a lift chair will never be covered by insurance then. We at Liberty recommend that a lift chair be purchased from a medical equipment store. A lot of stores out there, furniture stores, have lift chairs also, but there's a big difference between a lift chair you buy at a furniture store and a lift chair at a medical equipment store. At a medical equipment store, the chair, the motor exists and the chair is built around the motor. In a furniture store, a regular recliner is taken and a motor is installed onto it as an afterthought, so to speak. So when someone comes into one of our showrooms to look at lift chairs, we ask them a number of questions, um, starting with who the patient is or who's going to use that lift chair, um, what is the size of the patient or the person that's going to use it, is there any dementia involved with that person, because that'll determine which type of chair they best qualify for. So there are a number of different chairs and models. The main difference between the different um, styles, so to speak, are the motors. So a two-button lift chair okay. has two buttons on the remote, such as this brown one, and it goes up to stand the patient up, and it reclines all the way. But it just has two buttons, so it makes it a lot easier for someone with dementia. As opposed to a chair like this that has a lot of buttons, it has more capabilities and does more things, but it's confusing to the patient if they have dementia of any kind. Okay. So the chair with all the buttons like this ha is a dual motor. It has two motors in it because you can control the back separate than the feet. So you could be potentially sitting up with your feet up. So if someone has trouble sitting in a chair, it's good for a lift chair for them to start with it being up. So we're going to bring this one up. So then that way all they have to do is sit back like that, then use their buttons to bring the chair down. And then they can stop anywhere they like. Like if I don't even want to sit back that much, I can have my chair just sitting like this all the time. And then to get up, we just stand you back up. Yeah. Or the patient can do this too, just push the button. And it's nice and slow, so a lot of people the, will think they're gonna cut, catapult out of it, but they're not. And then you can just stand up the rest of the way. If I need to, I can still use my arms because I'm up higher, I'm not gonna hurt my rotator cuffs by pushing up. So if the patient is someone that uses a walker, it's very important that the walker be kept next to the chair. So when they sit down 
and then come back up to steady themselves, they've got their walker right nearby and ready to go. And they're not having to reach across the room or take steps without holding on to something. So on a chair with a dual motor, with all the buttons on the remote, you can program your favorite position, plus it comes with a zero gravity position, just like your favorite lawn chairs have these days. Um, it has the optimum TV viewing position. It has a sitting position, so you are sitting up, but your feet are up. And it also goes into a sleep position, so it goes flat into a bed position. So if you need to sleep in your chair, you can, although the chair is not made to do that. We ask where in the home the chair is going to be so that we can help them pick out a chair with the color and pattern fabric that'll work best in their home because it's a piece of furniture. It's not, yes, it's medical equipment, but it does not look like medical equipment. So it's a piece of furniture that'll be there in their homes for years and years and years. Okay, there's a wide variety of, of colors and fabrics that all the lift chairs are available in. Um, you've got your basic fabrics like this, and every chair has a number of fabrics that are standard in that model, which means there's no upcharges for that fabric. They've, there's also vinyls, which is really good for incontinence. And then there's a breeze of fabric, which is actually a faux leather. It looks like this. It's a great fabric. It feels like leather, but a little bit softer. It's better than vinyl. You can run your keys across it and it won't scratch. Um, you can clean it with a bleach solution. And so the Brisa fabric is very popular. You can have that a black Brisa chair in a hot window on a July day and that fabric will not fade, will not get hot to the touch. Very popular. And at Liberty Oxygen we also offer free delivery within the Twin Cities metro area. Um, for any lift chair that you get at any of our eight locations. And with that, when we do the delivery, it's not just landed on your doorstep as if you ordered it off the internet. We deliver it into your home, put it where it needs, get it, get it plugged in. All the lift chairs also have a battery backup, which is two 9-volt batteries in case your electricity goes out, and we do install those batteries when we set up. We give, put the first set of batteries in for you.